I can't wait to wear this shirt. It's giving me very much childish. It's giving me very much. Just give you guys a little bit of a rundown about the new uploading schedule on my channel, when and what time I will be uploading, and what video will be on what day. So Mondays will be just like regular vlogs, um, or if I decide to do challenges or any other videos, will be on Monday, and they will be uploaded at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. And then for Friday, it'll be fashion-related content, and also be uploaded at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time time yeah so basically um i kind of want my channel because i have kind of adapted into fashion a little bit here and there um i'm still trying to find like the aesthetic i like or like the type of vibe i go for i mean sometimes i dress girly sometimes i dress chill but yeah so basically that's pretty much it so let's go ahead and hop into this channel <laughs> Welcome to my channel where it can be uniquely used your girl uniquely J and for today's video it's gonna be a trial haul but today it's not gonna be a Shein one it's gonna be a Rome we one now if you don't know Rome we is like it's Shein but it's just a different company they sell the same products sometimes Rome we be cheaper sometimes it'd be a little bit more expensive than Shein it's just depending on what you're looking for what you're trying to buy and vice versa so personally i prefer i mean they're both the same but sometimes you do have like cuter pieces on rome we sometimes you have cuter pieces on shein it's just depending on what are you exactly looking for and i actually found a couple of pieces that i did could not find on shein on this website so <laughs> so before we get any further this video give this video a huge thumbs up comment down below other videos that you want me to do for you guys and if you haven't subscribed subscribe to my channel click that was gonna find me your girl upload for you guys and without further ado let's hop into this chart on haul all right so the first couple of items that i'm gonna be like showing you guys our bags it's two of them so the first bag we have is the t willie scarf color block bag it's in white red and black and it also has gold detailing on it i got this bag mainly because of the scarf that you can add to it as a little handle you know what i'm saying it also comes with this red strap so if you wanted to use it as a crossbody bag or like a regular bag and in order to like put the scarf on you have to put it through this hole and i guess tie it and then there's also another hole on the other side and then for the red um strap you use these two small holes on the side right there so i give this bag a seven out of ten because it's smaller than what i thought it would be in it i don't know it doesn't like i don't know i don't know it looked weird in person and this bag was four dollars and 95 cents so if you want to copy it, it'll be in the description bar down below. It is like kind of messed up at the bottom. It has like a couple of dents. They got a couple of like loose threads on there. I don't know if you guys can really see it good, but a couple of loose threads. So yeah, but I do like the scarf handle on of the bag, but 7 out of 10. All right, so moving on to the next item, which is another purse, which is... <laughs> I really love this purse. This purse is called the Fox Pearl Handle Satchel Heart Bag. It's a long one. It's a long name. It comes in this lavender lilac purple and it has gold detailing on it and stuff. And you know, it's a simple mini bag, whatever. They got the little pearl beads that you can hook onto the handle or you can use this gold chain as a cross battery. You know, I feel like you can use it as a fanny pack if you just Put it on right so for this bag i would give this a nine out of ten because it's way smaller than i expected it to be and it was nine dollars moving on to the next couple of items which will be shirts tops whatever you want to call them so basically i moved over so that i'll be able to like put the items that i am trying on on the screen okay period so the first shirt we have is the hook and eye frank tank top and it's in the extra small it's white um it comes with these little hooks that you can undo if you want to show more cleavage or if you want to show a little bit more stomach just depending on how you want to wear your shirt you can always adjust these loosen them up or you can have them like this it's a muscle shirt anyway so this is just a regular muscle shirt but it's like a stylish muscle shirt um and also at the front it's a little bit longer so it gives you the like v-shape at the front it has these 
little detailing on this side it like looks a little bit weird when i do have it on so yeah but besides that this is a 10 out of 10 it is soft it is stretchy and it's not as sheer as i thought it would be because a lot of um clothes and shirts especially unlike she in the room we could be sheer so it's you just gotta you know brace yourself for that kind of stuff but this shirt is a uh, you know soft it's a good material it's not too thick it's not too thin and this shirt was six dollars and 95 cents moving on to the next shirt so next we have the leopard plunge crop top um, so inside they have this little silver bar it's in a small it's stretchy i like the thick band that it has because sometimes it can be too thin and it like just doesn't look right when you tie it a certain way but i feel like if you you can use this top in many different ways if you just tie it right and style it right so i feel like this could be a multi-tie thing just depending on the kind of look you're going for it could be like a chill day look an elegant look or like a clubby attire just depending on you honestly i'll give this shirt a 10 out of 10 even though in the frame i did not tie it correctly so this shirt was six dollars and 95 cents and i give this a 10 out of 10 even though i didn't tie it right in the you know the little clip y'all seen but anyway moving on to the next shirt all right so the next top we have is the contrast stitching tank crop top and this is in a small this is just like a regular plain shirt it's not too much it's white stitching across and then at the bottom it's like a lettuce little thing going on i'm not really a big fan of the lettuce at the bottom <laughs> it's giving me very much childish it's giving me very much middle school shirt but the top part is cute so if this was gone i would give this a a eight out of ten but since the bottom is there I would give it a 5 out of 10. Um, it's just a plain shirt, honestly. And this was $6. Moving on to the next one. Alright, so the next shirt we have is the solid button down crop top um, in navy blue. Um, I thought it was supposed to be black, but it's navy blue. I would give this a 6 out of 10 because it doesn't fit as tight as I want it to fit. Um, the buttons, you can't unbutton them. They're just there for decoration. Like, the front part, you can't do anything with. It's just there for decoration. I feel like it would look better if it was black and it was, like, a little bit of tight fitting. This is a small, so I should have got an extra small if they had one. I'm not sure if they did. And this shirt was $6.95. That's that shirt. Alright, so the last shirt we have is not from Rome. We is actually from Shein. It was supposed to be in my last travel haul, but it ended up getting shipped out late. And it came around a week or two later. And and so I just decided to add it to this haul since Romwe and Shein's come in the same brand. Um, even though I don't think you can find this shirt on Romwe. So so this is the tie front puffer sleeve crop top in a brown. And it's in a extra small. And it's a tie up one. I'm starting to get into brown a little bit. So you know. So if you find the right brown to go with your skin tone. And it would be like you will fall in love with brown I feel. But anyway yeah. So I give this a 10 out of 10. It's exactly how I thought it would be. It fits perfectly and this was eleven dollars all right moving on to dresses now all right so the first dress we have is the one show to drawstring something dress and this is in a small and i got the dress because of you know i just felt like it would look cute and also because i don't really see too many people with this type of dress and also it has drawstrings on so if i wanted and also if i wanted to like adjust it to make it like a little bit higher i could and stuff like that so I got it because of that and also because it's nude and um i feel like this could be a possibly a birthday dress like a birthday dinner dress if you dress it up right so um if it's comfortable it got some um stretch to it i'm glad i did get small because originally if they had an extra small i was going to get it because typically with dresses sometimes i gotta get an extra small for it to fit and then sometimes i gotta get the small but anyway this dress was ten dollars uh, I definitely would recommend getting this dress. That dress is a 10 out of 10. The next dress I have is the solid cami body kind dress. I have a similar black one to this, but the other one is like more of like a tank top. This one is in healthy gray, and I feel like this looks cute on my skin because it's gray. You know what I'm saying? This is, in the, this is actually in the extra small. It is a little bit tight. I'm not going to cap. It's a little bit tight. It's a little bit tight, but you know, 
it's good material. It's not too thin. It's not too thick. It's perfect for like springtime, summertime. If you're looking for like a perfect like picnic dress, like a chill day, hanging out, hanging out kind of dress, and I would prefer you to get this. Um, you can wear it with sandals. You can wear it with heels if you want to kind of dress it up. You can wear it with tennis shoes. It's just depending on how you want to dress this up. I would give this a I would give this dress a 10 out of 10 and this dress was $13.95. So moving on to the last dress we have, which is the solid sleeveless bodycon dress. It is a dress that goes right above your knees and it's also in a brown color. It's like more of like a, this isn't a small, um, this is the same material as the last one I just showed you. But anyway, yeah, so I would recommend this dress if you're like chilling at the house or if you want to go somewhere that's like real chill real laid back like a, go out to eat with this like a chill restaurant or even go bowling you can even wear this as a cover-up if you wear it right um i just feel like you can make this into you can use this for more than one occasion you can make this outfit work depending on how you're trying to style it and stuff like that this dress is in a small i don't know if i told you guys that and this dress was six dollars and 95 cents so and this dress is a 10 out of 10. moving on to the last couple of items which are bikinis i know i bought a lot of them recently and i just have a lot overall but that's because i do have a trip coming up so the first so what we have is the flame pattern bikini swimsuit so this is the top this is how the top is looking you know it's just regular pink flames it's like dark pink and it got like pink highlighter on it it does come with pads inside of it to you know give it some um and protect it a little bit it has a little bit of a stretch but not too much depending on you you can always adjust it to how small you want it to be or how large you want it to be you know or how wide i mean so depending on you can have it either this wide or you can make it this small depending on what kind of look you're going for that day with the swimsuit i got i love pink pink is my favorite color so i got it because it was just something that would pop out that's the top now we're going to the bottom now the bottoms these things are fire but they do have some threads popping out as you guys can see some threads are popping out but besides that i love it it fits nice it's not too tight it um doesn't hug the body too much like where it's a little bit uncomfortable it doesn't do that it fits perfectly and stuff like that this is also in a small and this was eight dollars and 95 cents i would give that bikini a 10 out of 10. Well, moving on to the last item which is the rhinestone butterfly triangle bikini swimsuit and this is just how it looks it has rhinestones on it that have butterflies on them the top is the same as the last top you can make it small like this or you can have it wide like this you can always adjust it to how you want it to wear it it does also have pads in this one it's in black obviously and the wrong songs depending on how you do it it does reflect the light so this is also in the small that's the top moving on to the bottoms which is like a disappointment like i said this is in a small and this fit as if it was an extra small and i was just really really struggling because it was like a little bit uncomfortable that's the only thing i didn't like about it because it was a little too tight i didn't expect it to be that tight but it's the same material as the last bikini i just showed you guys so i don't understand why it fits a little bit tighter don't understand why and also they do have a couple of rhinestones missing if you guys can see that it's a couple of rhinestones missing as, as well but i would give that a 8 out of 10 for the missing rhinestones and how the bottoms fit me which is a little bit too tight but also you know sometimes you just never know with the sizing chart that um bikini was 11 dollars 95 and that's pretty much all the stuff that i bought from rome we in that one item from shein all right so that's the end of this try on haul i hope you guys enjoyed it comment down below um more people i should try like should i try jerry she more like fashion clothing vendors that you want me to try that you have ordered from or that you have heard good reviews about and you're not really sure if it's worth the hype or not because i'm going to be honest 100 honest especially if i'm spending my heart or money on things yeah but anyway neither here not there also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because the best to get notified when you grow up love you guys 
and until next time make sure you guys stay uniquely you and i will see you guys in my next 50 yo I've been sitting since I've been to the old lane, baby girl. I've been running.